way to a famous market in Japan called Tsukiji Market, which is a fish market. Um, it's the middle of rush hour, so there's a lot of people that are on their way to work. So I'm going to try to cheat to get into the market. I'm trying to follow some other tourists. Fortunately, they've already done U-turns a couple times, so I'm not sure if this is working out. But keep a safe distance behind them. I'm just following you, just uh, <laughs> assuming you that the you... the fish market? The fish market, yeah. This way. Where are you guys from? Atlanta. Oh, nice. Uh, I was in Arizona for a long time, and then I went to Kuwait to work for a while. Oh, wow. Yeah. And then I just quit my job, and I'm taking the year off. To travel? Yeah. Nice. Thank you. So how do you like Japan? Nine days. I've been here three days. I feel like I'm on a different planet. <laughs> <laughs> At first, yeah. You know, it's uh, but with technology, get around and there's an app you should get. Tokyo Subway it tells you to get from one station to one station, landmark to landmark. Right. So cool. Cool. Finally getting the hang of it, it's going to be time to go home. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the outer market around to, to I keep mispronouncing this, uh, Suzuki Market. Wow, you can smell the fish. Yeah. <laughs> It's just it's an open market with vegetables, meat, and of course lots and lots of fish. And you know the fish is fresh, it's right off the boat. Octopus. Oops. Want some octopus? This is some gnarly looking fish. I'm not sure if it's dried or just that's the way it is, but it looks awful. Look at this. It has to be dried fish. Uh, what is this? Squid leg. S squid? Squid leg. And this? Squid body. Um, leg? One leg? What's this? Eel. Anguilla. And this? Eel liver. Oh, uh, no. Yeah. Eel English, here. Ah, oh, okay, here. This. Yes. Yes. One of each? I don't know if she has a this is eel leg, and this is no, this is squid legs and eel I'm trying to get rid of these because I'm not in here, and I don't know where to put them. And I don't want to throw them away in the streets because there's just no trash. I am in the fish market and literally no trash. Anywhere. Anywhere. Oh, found my first trash can. Whew. I think I'm sticking to sushi. Ugh. Eel and the squid was terrible. So I am on my way to the market and I can I'm almost there. I can tell I'm almost there because the smell of the fish is just wafting in the air. It's pretty strong, okay. which is surprising given that I thought, you know, fresh fish isn't supposed to stink, but the smell is definitely in the air. It's crazy. So many cars. Try not to get them run over.
They have live fish. auctions um, that uh, are done early every morning. Now if you want to see the tuna auctions you really have to then time to get up early in the morning. Um, they start distributing tickets something like 5 or 6 a.m. in the morning and people line up before then. You know I thought about it but I wasn't prepared to get up that early especially for something where you have limited access and really um, it's, it's uh, for me, it wasn't worth getting up, you know, 3 or 4 a.m. in the morning just to go see the tuna auction. Um, um, shoes are getting wet. So this is the hall where the tuna auction would happen. And I guess... That lonely little piece over there did not get sold today. 